that's all I do Cause there is none that compares to you Cause all I want in this lifetime is you And all I want in this whole world is you, you, you Tell the world that Jesus lives Tell the world that, tell the world that Tell the world that he died for them Tell the world that he lives again No longer I but Christ in me It's the truth that set me free How could this world be a better place But by thy mercy, by thy grace Kiss all I want in this I miss you And all I want in this whole world is you, you, you Everybody now Tell the world that Jesus lives Tell the world that, tell the world that Tell the world that he died for them Tell the world that he lives again Tell the world that Jesus lives Hi kids, Uncle Dwight here again. Hope you had an amazing week in the Lord. And we are now up to chapter number 33 in our book. We've been doing God's Power in Me. And today's chapter is titled, I Am Anointed. And the vo vo uh, verse that it focuses on uh, comes out of Luke chapter 4, verse number 18. And it says, the Spirit of the Lord is on me because he has anointed me to preach good news to the poor. And this is what it says. It says, how many people have you told about Jesus? Or is talking about your faith kind of scary to you? It's natural to feel a little scared about sharing your faith. After all, some people think Christianity is crazy. But did you know that God has destined you to tell others about him? It's true. You have the power inside of, of you to talk about who God is and what Jesus has done for you and your family. In the Bible, anointing with oil is a symbol of the power of the Holy Spirit being given to someone for a designated task. Uh, Moses anointed Aaron for the priesthood. you find that in Exodus chapter 29. Uh, Samuel anointed kings. When Saul was anointed, the Spirit of the Lord came on him in power, you'll find that in 1 Samuel chapter 10. Did you know that the name for Jesus, Messiah, means anointed one? Uh, in Luke chapter 4, verse 18 through 19, Jesus quotes from Isaiah. Uh, he says, The Spirit of the Lord is on me because he has anointed me to preach good news to the poor. He has sent me to proclaim freedom for the prisoners and recovery of sight for the blind to set the oppressed free, and to proclaim the year of the Lord's favor. Uh, that's true healing. The same Spirit of the Lord 
the same anointing to preach good news that was on Jesus is on you. You have been anointed. <clears throat> you might not believe it. Maybe you haven't seen any evidence of an anointing, but it's there. Maybe you haven't seen any evidence. Um, sorry. All you have to do is to believe in it. God has given you his power, his Holy Spirit power to help you to do what he's called you to do. Share the good news of his grace. As a child of God, you are, you are a spiritual powerhouse of liberation and healing everywhere you go to set captives free, to restore others physically and emotionally, to usher in the wonders of God's kingdom. There might be some people who you are scared to death to share your faith with. You just know they won't listen or worse yet, they, might, they will get mad at you. But you do not have to fear what people will do to you when you listen to God's word. He promises to give you the power to do what he's called you to do. You are God's living testimony, anointed with the power of the Holy Spirit to bring good news to everywhere you go. Wow. And then it says here under the journaling, it says, Today make a list of all the people you know who don't know Jesus. After you've made the list, pray and ask God to open their hearts, their ears, and their minds. Ask Him to give you the chance to talk to them and share Him uh, with them. Wow, that's awesome. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank you so much, Lord, for this anointing. Um, I just pray, Lord, that uh, your anointing is upon all the children out there, that you have someone in mind uh, that you want for them to share the good news of Jesus with them, Lord. And we thank you, Lord, that someone did that for us, that they shared who Jesus is and, um, and brought healing and restoration and forgiveness in our life because of uh, that sharing. And I just pray, Lord, for boldness, that special anointing that we talked about upon all the children out there, that as they encounter a friend or someone uh, who you might want to have, have them talk to, to share about who you are, Jesus, the Son of God, and that you bring forgiveness, you bring healing, you bring power into our lives, you bring peace and joy, and so much more, Lord. And I just pray, Lord, that you give all of us that boldness, boldness to share the good news of Jesus with others around us. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. All right, kids. Well, until next time, God bless you and take care. Bye-bye.